What is going on, Libra? Two Shades Remain, 336 Tarot here. How are y'all doing today? I hope you're having a fantastic day. All right, listen, y'all. This is, of course, with the sage, setting the intention to cleanse, remove, protect, and purify our space, our energy, the cards, our auric field of any and all negativity, negative energy, low vibrational energy sent intentionally or unintentionally from those known and unknown, including ourselves. This is your DFE, y'all. <laughs> this is your DFE, okay? Um, yeah, y'all. I hope that you are doing well, okay? I, look, I had to get my life in order. Sage, okay, very good. Listen, DFE, look, today the moon energy is crazy, y'all. It's the new moon in Pisces today, okay? So, I hope you're setting your intentions, all right? I hope you're setting your intentions for things to come, things that you want to manifest, all right? Um, yes, new beginnings, new things happening for y'all. Um, let me get some incense lit for you guys because I didn't have that done. We're just, we're, we're going with it. I'll say, okay, so this is your new moon in Pisces energy reading okay like divine feminine empowerment reading okay we're gonna have some fun and, and have a great reading see what's going on with spirit get this clarity okay y'all my chair i don't know I'm, I'm i look shadowed and tore it up so bad oh my goodness he has torn he didn't tore it up so bad okay y'all let's meditate i don't know what's going on we should be meditating let's clear the energy let's get ready y'all i'm so excited let's go All right, y'all, listen, I feel like you guys um, are so just like very and feeling very inspired, Libra. Okay, very inspired. I love that. Um, of course, we want y'all to come up balanced. So we're going to see what spirit wants to talk about. Spirit, spirit guides, ancestors, and angels of the highest and purest light vibration and energy. What is the clarity? What is the clarity? What is the tear clarity for my dear Gemini? No, did not Gemini Libra. I'm sorry. Don't be judging me. I've read for Gemini. Okay. I'm sorry. My bad. What is the old? Let's get a go. A goddess power oracle. Okay. See what we got going. Ready. I'm ready for you. Forgiveness. Bronwyn, number seven. Okay, Libra. Um, so this is some very, very well may be some success that's coming. Some like successful forgiveness that has happened. Maybe, maybe this is with yourself. Like forgiving yourself for things that you have gone through that maybe hurt you. Um, relationships. This is you forgiving yourself and moving right along. Okay, with the number seven chariot card, because that is the number of the chariot. Okay, so this is you forgiving yourself and moving on from that, not staying in the energy. Um, so some of you, you may be releasing as well as setting intentions today. Okay, there's nothing wrong with that. Let's get some moon cards because it is the new moon in Pisces today. Okay, so forgiving yourself for things that have been, for things that went wrong, that, that for things that didn't happen the way that you wanted them to, or you were expecting them to. Sometimes we have to check them expectations, right? We have to check our expectations and realize, like, hey, we can't, we can't, we can't, we can't make anything happen. We can only make decisions for our highest good and let spirit help us with the outcome. Okay. Okay, let's get a soul card or two. Very good, very good. Forgiving yourself and moving on. Forgiving yourself and moving on. 
emotions are running high super moon okay i feel that with the forgiveness right coming showing up as the overall energy some of you may very may be very emotional some of you may be very in, in your head and it's because you're trying to process your emotions you're trying to process this forgiveness so you may be highly sensitive so be mindful of your reactions to people okay um be mindful of just if you ain't got to give it time don't give it time okay um so check yourself before you wreck yourself that song that's a song i don't know child that's a song <laughs> okay <laughs> so you may be highly sensitive and it may be because the moon in all her beautiful glory right now our our new moon in pisces and pisces water sign hello emotions hello emotions are running high so some of you may have a real affinity for the moon like i do i have an affinity for the moon um so be mindful that that may be kind of mm, messing with you a little bit okay what else spirit what else is what is the clarity show me clarity show me clarity for Jump clarity. I'm oh, sorry, y'all. So I look, I zoned out. They started giving me messages and I had to get my life in order because I felt myself go out for a second. Show me tear clarity for Libra spirit. That was crazy. Adjustments are required. This card came out for somebody else in a different position though, right? So moving forward, you're going to know the, for the decisions to make the adjustments that need to be made, right? So that you're not going through or dealing with the same type of situations that you dealt with before. Okay, so there may be like some worry for some of y'all that you would be repeating a situation or going back through something or doing some doing it again. Well, you won't, number one, because we can't repeat it, right? We can't repeat anything. We can't go back where there's no do-overs. If it's done, it's done. All right, and that's it. So it's like, well, okay, you can't repeat it. So guess what you learn from it and we take what we've learned and we know what we like what we didn't like what we want to do what we what we don't want to do we know all of that right so sorry y'all i needed that in my life oh my gosh look i need some more okay <laughs> listen so um this is knowing how to make adjustments as you move forward so you're not repeating things and going through things the same way again okay if that makes sense for you all um for y'all if that makes sense for y'all i don't even know i don't even say you all for you all who's, who even says that y'all i say y'all i'm sorry but i do i say it a lot y'all know i'm country i was just telling somebody that today i know i'm country i am am is and is I grew up in the South, okay. I am a Southern Belle living, um, but no, I'm not. Any, well, I am. But message, <laughs> look, Spirit said, no, you're not. That's not where you're from. I can't even, hold on, y'all. I forgot that that. <laughs> Spirit got jokes, okay. Spirit is playing the whole, look, play is not playing, right? Spirit say, yeah, you're not from the South anymore. No, you're not. You're West Coast. West Soy? I received that. Okay, look, let's go. Spirit, I'm not finna. <laughs> what do I need to know about Libra? Are y'all laughing at me? You laughing? That was funny for me. I'm sorry. I had a moment. Spirit said, the devil is a lie. <laughs> Very good. How is Libra showing up this week, Spirit? Spirit guides, ancestors, and angels are the highest and purest light vibration and energy. What is the clarity for Libra? What is the clarity for Libra? How is Libra showing? How are you showing up this week, Libra? Let's go. Let's let's come. Let's see how we're coming through with what we got going on. Very good. Okay, listen. Look. 
the high priestess i see you look going within forgiving yourself listening to your inner wisdom and guidance as look that's the adjustments mm, high priestess ish for my libras okay i see you being receptive, open to ideas coming in, learning. Some of you may just be like increasing your meditation practices, really learning how to go with, like, listen to yourself. Okay. Um, very good. This says meditate and turn. Oh, thank you, Spirit. Meditate and turn inward to discover your soul's true desire. This is not a time for action. So some of y'all, whatever, if they're, if you have been trying, thinking about taking action on something, Spirit is saying this is not the time for that. Okay. This is not the time for you to take action. This is the time for you to sit back, be reflective, be observant, see what's going on around you before you decide if you really want to put all your time, effort, and energy into something before you want to really put all your money into something before you really want to commit yourself or oh it because it would be an over commitment spirit is saying make sure that it's something that you want to do before you decide to really invest this is not the time to take action okay develop your intuitive gifts and trust the wisdom you receive this is a, when you take the time to learn how to be still listen to yourself learn what your body how your intuition talks to you that is developing your intuition that way you can hear no matter what what's going on because you will know it, it's more about it's well I'm, you can hear it yes but it's more about feeling feeling that it's right feeling that you're doing the right things just having this knowing and it's like you don't know why you know you just know because you know and it's just like I know and it's like you, you know yeah I know okay well I don't know how I know but I do right it's like the crazy it's crazy that's you <laughs> it's like i can't explain it i just know when you know something you just know and you can develop that and build that and so that's something you can definitely be working on okay libra but it looks like you've already been doing that like learning to be still receptive listen, listen to messages and allowing things to come like just trusting yourself right therefore you're going to bring in trustworthy people because we are what we attract yes very very good very good very good very good what's in the foundation no what's crossing you helping or hurting helping or hurting oh look options and so there was there may have been some there there was some it's like some confusion dang i was trying to get it out okay seven of cups coming in confusion confusion was the first thing that i heard um, a lot of options and a lot of confusion around for some of you having to make a decision make a choice okay you you're the only one who can make the choice you can get wisdom truth clarity wisdom guidance advice um you if this is all going to come back to you getting still and listen to yourself and learning and so you can decide how to what decision to make stop procrastinating or over analyzing so this is about quieting your mind that meditation will help with that as well i want to start doing like some meditates like some meditations i don't know how to say it but it's like i have specific meditations that i use when i'm trying to help myself anyway get clarity on what you desire and move forward look on youtube and find like meditation do like sound baths and sound bowls okay if you're having trouble even sleeping you can use that to help you go to sleep as well um, having too many options thank you spirit addictions right some of you may be dealing with addictions i understand i've been there done that okay make a choice stop procrastinating or over analyzing okay get clarity if you need help get help okay there's no there's no shame in asking for okay there's no shame in, there's no shame in asking for help all right um but this is also for a lot of you making a choice okay libra make a choice let's get what's in the foundation bam we have the oh come on spirit the queen of pentacles is coming in okay so this is you building firm foundations okay you being very practical with your money your finances some of you may have been working on a budget um the ability to make things anything more beautiful some of you um have kind of changed up your look maybe right maybe you looked some one way which is kind of like you're normal for a long time maybe you've done something a little different with yourself okay libra i see you okay i see you okay listen um of the love of art and beauty some of you might just want to get out do something different go to like a museum or something something random off the wall i know that don't make sense but why do the same thing you always done Right, do something else okay it'll be fun i'm taking that i'm doing the same thing okay 
Uh, materialistic, the ability to make anything more beautiful. We talked about that, a sensible approach. Again, being sensible with your money, your mind, your time, your resources with this Queen of Pentacles. Also taking care of home. Some of you had to sh like clean, clean up, clean home up right like maybe had to make sure that you let people know like hey you're not just gonna do whatever you want to do at my house sorry that was for somebody okay what's in the recent past look the four of cups okay four of cups coming up 1441 444 on the thing and the number four coming up right here okay failing to recognize a magical opportunity missing the point um, make sure that you are not so focused on the outcomes, number one, okay? Um, make sure that you, on you trying to control what happens that you don't miss an opportunity. The distractions of daily life. Look, we know we got distractions with the Seven of Cups that's coming in. Um, did I show y'all this card, this Four of Cups? Look, the angels back there um, trying to guide you and give you an opportunity. Make sure that you're not missing that opportunity. Maybe you're feeling a little bored. Of course, that's this this card, bored and, ap bored and apathetic. Lost in your own world. Like, wake up. Okay, see this. See, you have to make sure that you are seeing things clearly with this high priestess and this seven of cups. That's definitely saying confusion. What's going on in your thoughts? Okay, let's talk about that. What's in your thoughts? What's in your thoughts? Libra. Oh, the hermit wanting to be alone for some of y'all. Some of you just are, are happy doing this like inner work and inner reflection that you have with the hermit and high priestess that's coming in, right? Some of you are really happy about spending time alone, alone and really learning about yourself is what this hermit is telling me. Learning about yourself did, and just enjoying meditation and realizing like how peaceful it is and how serene it is and how much comfort it gives you, right? When you're connecting to your higher self and you know, like your ancestors and spirit guys when you get to that point oh, oh look thank you spirit time spent in peaceful meditation and meaningful solitude okay this is like when you learn to when, when you're learning about yourself and truly tapping in and forgiving yourself for past transgressions and things when you're truly like healing, because this is saying healing to me because forgiveness is healing okay when you are healing um from, from situations and just from life and really seeking out the parts of yourself that you have kept hidden for so long. It's so beautiful. This is beautiful. Okay. This because you're wanting to learn yourself. You're wanting to um, shine your light as well. Maybe it was dim. Maybe some, maybe you were oppressed, right? Maybe you were dealing with somebody who kept you in the dark, maybe, but you kept yourself in the dark as well. But this is knowing that you have the ability to shine with this hermit car because you're shining okay look look at the look at the shine that's coming out the shine you were this is your light can't nobody diminish that and you know that okay this is what we're saying this is in your thoughts i love to see it knowing your power knowing your worth in the past you may have missed opportunities because maybe you didn't believe in yourself with this hermit card that's coming in maybe you didn't believe in yourself maybe you didn't believe in your gifts your talents maybe and you didn't trust yourself right with this high priestess that's next to the four of cups you didn't trust yourself so you ended up having a hard time making decisions with this seven of cups okay but now you know how to trust yourself what's going was we're getting the outcome what's the outcome spirit then we're going to get a message from your guides. Do what? No. Oh, okay. Sorry. Well, this, is, this is our outcome card, y'all. What is the outcome for Libra? These readings have ran a little longer. Look, it came back, so I'm going to do it. Outcome is the Five of Swords. Look, I, I I asked the first time, like, is this it? They said, and I thought they said, and I was like, I thought I heard them say yes, but I was like, I'm going to just see if it, they said, <laughs> I said what I said, so now they're saying it's for me again. That spirit, be not, you're knocking me in the head, right? Listen to what I said, five of swords. So make sure that you are not, um, who, how do I say that? <laughs> um, 
Okay, this says an unwise choice. So just make sure that you are trusting your intuition and it's not the difference between your intuition and your ego. Thank you, Spirit. When you're making decisions, when you're making having to make choices so that you are leading with your um, in your knowing, okay? Um, avoid people who lack integrity. So make sure that people around you are on the up and up with you, okay? If they ain't, if they are, are they on the up and up with you? If they not, then we ain't got time. We don't want to deal with that because we have great things that are happening. We are learning ourselves, building foundations and working on our money okay um there's a better way that will make you happier so be open to new ideas and opportunities is what that is telling me okay um this is not always about winning at any cost i know the meaning of the card but i don't always read the meaning of the card i read intuitively okay so this is saying don't feel and some of y'all make sure if you've had a look addictions Come through spirit. Thank you. Look, they just made me look down at this card and see this gambler, this person gambling. So some of you may have be may be gambling or had gambling problems. Be mindful of that. That's they, they said something about addictions. Be mindful of gambling, spending your money unnecessarily. Okay. We are, we're using our money to build firm foundations. So be mindful of overspending with this Queen of Pentacles and this Five of Swords. Okay. Be mindful of overspending like Libra. You know, you got to stay balanced. Keep the balance, the budget balanced. Okay, some of you may have let some financial matters kind of fall to the wayside, kind of didn't like try to put it out of sight, out of mind, but it's going to come back up to the forefront. You got to take care of your business. Okay, Queen of Pentacles, handle your business, your business, handle your business. Okay, that's going to be necessary for you guys. You can't run from it. It's going to come around. It's going to come back around. So don't, don't delude yourself. This, this is showing me like delusions on this. Don't delude yourself and think that it's not going to be, it's not going to come back up. You're going to have to just square it up and deal with it. Okay, you're going to be off and you're going to be fine. Whatever this situation is for you. Okay, in regards to your finances is what I can say on that. Okay. Very good. Let's get some guys some meds from medicine, <laughs> medicine, some messages from your guides. All right, here we go. Messages from your guides. Messages from your guides. One more time. Thank you. What is going on for you? All right, now that I've done that, did we not? I don't remember we did it that time. All right, here we go, y'all. Messages from your guides for Libra. They said there's only two. Oh, and we have two that are on the air. What do we have? Let's go to for Libra hero and beginnings coming in for you guys. So let's read it. First, a new dawn has emerged. This is a time to celebrate change, newness, and growth. Mm -hmm. Okay, you better. Beginnings coming in many forms. This could signal a time for a new job, home, relationship. Some of you may have new ideas that are coming in as well, um, like creative ideas that are coming in, new beginnings that are just happening left and right all over the place. You're seeing things happening, but it's also manifestation. They're showing me manifestation. Did I say something to y'all earlier? Don't be judging me about my missing fingernail. I know it's missing. I know. I'm gonna get it done, okay? <laughs> this is good, but I be sure I'm showing it off just as proud and it is. You have worked hard to get where you are. Stop to appreciate all that you have, the things that it, the, it's like, stop to appreciate what it took to get you there, okay? That's this four, they're showing me four swords on this. I know it's four cups. They're showing me that you had a time of reflection because this is showing up in your past. And you also have the hermit here and the high priest is definitely showing inner knowing, inner wisdom, okay? Then you are, you have a hero. You are on a hero's journey. This came out for somebody else. You can, you cannot go to war with someone else, even if you don't, if you don't give them um, give them one. Okay. Don't let anybody bait you up. I'm hearing this. Be the bigger person. Stay like, you don't have, when you don't have time, just be like, look, I ain't got time. 
Don't even worry about dealing with that. Okay, dealing with unnecessary people. Your spirit guys are saying, listen, don't give a time, effort, and energy to people who it's like a dead-end situation, dead-end communication. I just heard, okay? If somebody is not returning or reciprocating your time, effort, or energy, then don't, don't feel no type of way about putting them to the wayside and not dealing with them because that is them trying to why why do you you don't have to always invest energy it's about reciprocity okay um but this is about trusting your inner knowing and, and again realizing which one is you're using to lead you guys you may give you information as you're making decisions okay remember that using your discernment okay very good listen i hope that this was helpful for you okay um libra if this resonated at all or because it's been closed for me for a while but i am now opening my personal readings back up and i'm super excited to connect with you guys so i hope that i get to connect with you visit my website touchegermain.com to book a personal one-to-one -one reading link is also uh, it's also in the description box okay listen i want you to drink the water say gratitude all that good stuff um yeah Drink your water, say a gratitude, and have a fantastic day. And I will see y'all next time, all right? Send it lots of love, light, and healing energy. Hit the thumbs up. Oh, hit the thumbs up if it resonated for you. I appreciate you. All right. Bye, y'all. <laughs>